Praise God, hallelujah. Good morning to you all. Amen. Praise the name of Jesus. Wherever you are, begin to bless the name of the Lord this morning. Begin to give him all the praise, give him all the glory, give him all honor, give him all adoration. Can you sing any song of your choice to him? Just worship him in the beauty of his holiness. Give him all the worship, give him all the praise. Thank you, Father, for this morning. For the breaking of another day, Boruba Casa Pali Bozodo Zebe Rebe di Boro Casa Bahia Le Grozo Goto Baraba di Becaso Baran di Bahali Brocosi Brahali Broco di Bocosi Brahan Desia Rozo Goto Baraga di Gesu Brahali Bahia Pray in the Holy Ghost, pray in the Spirit. Mindi Rabaduka Prani Arabaka di Caraba di Baholi Abo Igra Liga Ragadiga Zagara Gandi Carava Cosuba Gali Bahia. Bruza Gadiga Zagora Galiga Ravada Bakosuba Rapale Bahia, Ragadiga Zagora Gadiko Sopra Lipaka Bagadia, Debra Hali Broko di Bakara Bohadia, Ragadiga Zagora Galiko Robadiga Zagora Diga Zobra Haliba, Rosso Padara Dia, the Gadiga Zagora Galiko Zubara Batigazia, Menda Rabadiga Zagora Batiga Zagora Baliba Halibahadia. I want to pray in the Holy Ghost, Grelika de Baragadiko Zubara Galika Rabahadia. I want to pray the Holy Ghost that Garabako di Bogadia, Garagatiko Zobrahadia, Radika Yatakoni Bogadia. Everybody pray the Holy Ghost. I saw the Lord has done it for somebody. Soma, the Lord has done it for you. Everybody pray the Holy Ghost. Pray the Holy Ghost, everybody. Amen. Ori Bogadia, Galiga Ragatika Zagaragati Bogadia, Ragatika Zagarabako di Bogadia, Ragatika Zagaragatika Zagaragara. Everybody pray in the Holy Ghost. Something is being released. Something is something, something is happening. Pray in the Holy Ghost. If you cannot pray in the Holy Ghost, just begin to say thank you, Jesus. Just pray in the Spirit if you can. Pray in the Holy Ghost. Melagada pa blowing tongues. Kabash in the Spirit. Pray in the Spirit. Whatever stands as an obstacle around us. Whatever stands as an interest around us, let the power in the, of the Holy Spirit begin to break them down as we pray in the Holy Ghost right now. Ragadi Bokoso Barabahadia, Kayak Bokoti Bokodia, Rabakati Bokosi Bahaya, Ragate Bokosi Bahadia, Manga Bahadia, O Barabakadia. In the life of Midi, listen, I hear this song, Shira Re Logo, Shira Re Logo. Just be worshiping God, tell God to glorify Himself in your life in worshiping songs. The Lord said, we did it this seven days. I will glorify myself in your life. Everybody pray in the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name, we pray in tongues. Now, we want to pray the essence of today. Lord, I said, Lord, what are we doing today? Daddy said, today is mercy day. Daddy said to me that today is mercy day. Every prayer that we shall pray will be surrounded around mercy this morning because that is what the Lord says somebody needs. That is what the Lord says somebody is about to experience. That's what the Lord says so that is about to open up something for somebody. That is what God wants to walk with on this prayer altar this morning. Now, in the book of Luke chapter 2, sorry, in the book of Luke chapter 1, <clears throat> when I look at verse 25, 
The Bible says, and thus thus the Lord has dealt with me in the days when he looked on me to take away my reproach among people. That was Elizabeth talking. God looked dealt with me in those days and looked on me and he took away my reproach. When I read verse 57 and 58 of that same chapter one, the Bible said that, and God and the neighbor, and sorry, and when Elizabeth full time was come, the Bible said, and she delivered, gave forth, brought forth a son. And the Bible said, verse 58, that and the neighbor saw that what God has shown great mercy. And the neighbors came to rejoice that God has shown great mercy to Elizabeth. Ah, people of God, it is mercy that removes reproach. The Lord said, I am going to remove reproach this morning. Ah, what is that thing like reproach? Let me explain. Elizabeth and Zechariah, they were serving God. They were serving God wholeheartedly. They were serving God with all their heart. This fact, that they were serving God with all their heart, they were not having a child. Ah, there were people that never go to church, never were in the place of service, but they had all manners of children. They were not praying. They were not as dedicated to the things of God like they. The Bible said that these ones from their youth, there was no, they were blameless. They were, they were devoted to kingdom service. It does not rhyme. It does not add up. How can you serve God? and still be dying of what the unbeliever does not even cry for to death. How can you be serving God and be sick? How can you be serving God and be buried? How can you be serving God and be seen all kinds of limitations? How can you be a giver? How can you be a devoted, dedicated personality? But there's something that has become a prayer point that is not going in your life. It is a reproach. I want you to pray this morning. I want you to cry out to God and say, oh God, this morning, show me great mercy. Open your mouth and pray. Say, by your mercy this morning, swallow up every reproach in my life. Take it away totally. Open your mouth and pray. Lord, oh God, I have come to ask, to demand for great mercy. My father, Great mercy. Why should we be serving God like this in our family and no marriage? Why should we be serving God like this in our family? Our marriage does not stay. Oh God, is the devil so powerful than you? Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. I want you to cry out. This is to reproach your Christian life. This is a mockery to mock that you are just praying. Yeah, you are just fasting. I want you to declare and pray this morning and say, oh God, by your great mercy, around my life this morning, swallow up every reproach, swallow up every reproach, swallow up every reproach, swallow up every reproach. reproach. Open your mouth and make that declaration. I run my life this morning now. Swallow up every reproach, every reproach by your great mercy. Flow back up, by your mercy, by your mercy. Let your mercy swallow up every reproach around my life, every reproach around my marriage, every reproach around my career, every reproach around my business, every reproach. How can you be believing God for something year in, year out? 10 years, one thing. I want you to pray. This has become a reproach, my father. Lord, oh God, I cry out for your great mercy this morning. Ah, you will deal with me your great mercy. Oh Lord, my God. Show me great mercy. 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 Show my children great mercy. Show my husband great mercy. Show my wife great mercy. Show us great mercy. Malukwara bakadia, by your great mercy, swallow up our rebuke. Lakarabahosibaya, Razubara bakadia, Eruzubara bakadia, Lapadiba Kosubaha, Kalika Bakodubaha, Shandoro Bokodubaha, Lapadiba Kazaha, Gayika Tamoso, Gayika Matusa, Ikrabakuri Bakaya, Rabaduba Kazabaha, Raduba Rabakadia, Malik de Bogosia, Shadara Bakadia, Malik de Bakadia. I want you to cry out this morning on this altar. Whatever look like a reproach in my life. Oh, Jesus. 
open your mouth and mention this thing I am going through. It is becoming a reproach. This thing I am passing through, it is becoming a reproach. This thing that is delaying my life, it is becoming a reproach. Oh God, show me great mercy this morning and by your mercy, swallow up this reproach. Let me not see it again. Swallow this reproach completely. Swallow up this reproach totally. Swallow up this reproach finally. Swallow up this reproach totally. Open your mouth and begin to pray. I don't know why I'm dwelling on this. I want you to make that declaration. Every reproach among my siblings, every reproach in my family, every reproach among my father's children, among my mother's children, open your mouth and begin to pray. Oh God, show forth your great mercy in my family this morning. Show forth your great mercy concerning my health. Show forth your great mercy concerning my dealings. Show forth your great mercy concerning my pursuit. Let me receive mercy. There is somebody here this morning. You are going to receive great mercy. Because of you, a whole institution will change the process. Because of you, a whole institution, they will wait. They will they will wait again. Something will wait because of you. Just be, You might not know it's because of you, but it is because of you. There is going to be a wait in the Bahaya so that something will not close up. Ah, the Sunni Mahai da Bahaya. Everyone on the prayer altar this morning receive great mercy. Let God show you great mercy this morning. Let God show you great mercy this morning. I cry out to heaven, to the God of the heavens and the earth, to the one that seated in the highest throne and ruled in the affairs of man. Let show great mercy by his mercy this morning. Let him wipe away our sorrows. Let him wipe away our reproach. Everything that has become a reproach in your life, anything that has become a reproach in your life, that has become a mockery, this morning, by mercy, let it be swallowed up. By mercy, let it be rolled away. By mercy, let it be removed from your life. That thing that cannot be connected to you serving God. How can you be serving God? And your life is under threat. How can you be serving God? And you are going through one challenge to the other. Delay the whole backing of glory. How can you be serving God and you're going through strange rejection? And you know scriptures that says when you serve God, good to follow you. Ayadu kapara, so tabi, it is reproach. It is reproach. Let mercy swallow it up this morning. 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 Up this morning. In Jesus' name we pray. We declare by mercy. Let your waiting season be over. By mercy. I don't know who I've just prophesied to. I don't know who I've just prophesied to. Your waiting season is over. By mercy. Your waiting season is over. By mercy. Your waiting season is over. By mercy. Receive that mercy that put an end to your waiting season. Receive that mercy that put an end to your waiting season. I don't know who I've just spoken to. Receive that mercy that put an end to your, to your waiting. Receive that mercy that put an end to your waiting. Ah. Uh, there is somebody on this prayer altar. The yoke of what the enemy put on your neck has been broken. I want you to turn your neck and discover that you are healed. And if you discover that, I want you to raise your hand on the prayer altar. I want to pray more for you. I want to speak in your life. I want to congratulate you. I don't know what you're going through on your neck. Every thought has been coming to you. 
Are you sure you're not going to go through this? Are you sure you're not, they will hang something on your neck? I don't know what is going on on your neck, but I just saw something just broke right now. Something just broke right now. About three hours, about three hours ago, I don't know, you were not comfortable on your neck, but the chain is broken. Check your neck, check it, check it, check it. God has just taken away that yoke. Right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, I don't know who this world is hitting in the spirit. The waiting season is over. By mercy, 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 by mercy. Receive mercy that we put an end to your waiting season. That you have waited for. That you have waited for. Let the waiting season be over. Let manifestation season show. Let the waiting season be over. Let manifestation season show. Let the waiting season be over. Let manifestation season show. Let the waiting season be over. Let your miracle t- oh, yes, is a comfort. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. We are praying. The Bible says it is because of his mercy we are not consumed. Can you give that word a box? Because of his mercy, you and I we are not consumed. Hallelujah. Because of his mercies, we are not consumed. What are the things that want to consume us? The, 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 the rage of darkness. The enemy wants to consume us. The enemy wants us to be destroyed. Sickness wants to destroy us. The enemy has strange intentions, demonic desires, arrows from dark places. The Bible says it is because of his mercies. You and I were not consumed. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. We are going to be praying. Ah, everything that wants to consume us. Let mercy begin to show. It is because of his mercies we are not consumed. It is because of his mercies we are not consumed. When that, when mercy operates in your life enough, there is no way the enemy can consume you. There is no way demonic altar can consume you. Just have mercy enough. Just have mercy enough. It is because of this mess that we are not consumed. We are going to be praying. Now, let me give another um, let me analyze something else I was going to use to pray. Jonah. 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 Jonah was thrown into the water because he was discovered that he was the cause of whatever they were going through. The moment they threw him there, a, a, a big fish swallowed him. Literally, was supposed to die that he can't survive it. What is he going to survive for in the belly of a fish? The well, scripture tells us that Jonah came to a point. He said, Those who forsake, who consider lying vanities, forsake their own mercy. From the writings of Jonah, we understood that what Jonah cried for in the belly of that fish or wherever in the process of mercy, in he, he cried out for his own mercy. And the same fish that was a dead end, the same fish, people who threw him into the water thought it was over. They never thought they were ever heard of anybody called Jonah again. The place that was supposed to end him, that was supposed to consume him, terminated his ministry forever. It was by mercy he became a new start for them. It what was meant to kill him now become the source of temptation. I want you to pray. That is what mercy does. That is what mercy does. It converts destruction. It converts it to instruction. It converts destruction. It converts it to your flights. I want you to pray. Whatever was meant to destroy me shall now become my reason of testifying. Shall become my flights. Shall be, shall be for my rising. Whatever was meant to kill me Ah, sir, if you see a man that everybody thought was going to die, that survived, sir, is mercy. When people have given up, it's they, when they are no longer praying. Even if they are praying, it's not prayer of hope. It's not prayer of faith. It is a it is mockery prayer. It's the prayer of the ones that have given up. Only mercy saves a man from a concluded case. 
I want you to cry out and pray this morning. I want you to pray for your own mercy. Oh God, Lord, show me mercy this morning. Everything that has been concluded for my downfall, let it be the reason why I will rise. Everything that was meant to finish me, finish my ministry, finish my marriage, finish my calling, finish my business, open your mouth and pray. Let it be my transportation to my destiny. Let it be my transportation to my destiny. Let it be the reason why I will arrive early. Let it bring about speed in my life. Whatever the enemy has planned, Borus Kayade Kaziba, that was meant for my end. Let it bring about a beginning of beginning by your mercy, 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 by your mercy. Everybody cry. Any cry you are crying this morning, just be calling mercy. Just be calling mercy. Just be calling mercy. Mercy is not just the forgiveness of sin. Marufu barabakadia. Langradikadia doya. Engradikadia da. Golo barabakadia. Mercy is the partiality of God. Kayi kata bakuziba. Regadikizi kadaya. Ragadikuzu barabakadia. Langradikadika degadia. Ruka di kradi ke ya kutuba ya roba raba kadi ba kadi ya bradi kuzu ba kudi ya karapa kadi ba kuzi ya rekedi kuzu ba raba dara kadi kuzu ba gayi kada ba kuzi ba roka di ba kada ba kada raba kudi ba kadi ya paraba kadi ba kaya open your mouth and pray whatever was made for my calling for my destruction le kradi ba kadi ya let it turn out for my testimony by your mercy by your mercy by your mercy by your mercy by your mercy. Ah, Jonah was supposed to have been finished in that sea. Instead, they heard the same Jonah was preaching in a particular city. He was preaching in a particular city. He was preaching in a particular city. And everybody gave their life to Christ. The same fish that swallowed him was the one that carried him for that crusade. Carried him for that crusade. Because he said, those that consider lying vanity forsake their own mercy. With, with the, the plenty of the fish that he died, he came back. I want you to pray by your mercy. Whatever was dead in my life, whatever was forgotten, a close case, a close case, by your mercy, let there be revival. By your mercy, let it be reversed. By your mercy, let life come again. By your mercy, whatever was made for my end, that the enemy felt they have closed concerning me. Oh Lord, by your mercy. Open it again by your mercy. Open it again in Jesus' name. We pray. James two thirteen. The Bible says, "Mercy prevails over judgment. Mercy prevails over judgment. Mercy prevails over judgment." I want you to begin to declare every judgment that has been passed against me in the spirit, every verdict that has been passed against me in the spirit, every witchcraft conclusion over me and my family. I want you to declare. The Bible says mercy prevails over judgment. Let mercy begin to swallow it. Let mercy begin to reverse it. Let mercy begin to overcome it. Overcome every judgment. Overcome every satanic verdict, witchcraft verdict, witchcraft conclusion, satanic assault. Open your mouth and pray. That has been concluded over me in the spirit. Be reversed by mercy. Be reversed by mercy. Mercy prevail. Lord, oh God, show forth that mercy in my life this morning. Let the mercy begin to reverse every satanic condemnation. Every judgment that has been passed over my life and my family. Mercies of God. Mercies of God. Reverse it. Open your mouth and pray. I receive that job by mercy. I receive that business by mercy. I receive that money by mercy. I receive it by mercy. I don't know what you want to receive. Begin to declare receive it by mercy. I see people receiving by mercy. Everything we are doing today is mercy. 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 Open your mouth and make that declaration. Declare it right now. Mangu guzupa, jaga daba kodo bakada, igara bakada bakodiya, gali kodo bakere kere kere. Receive what you have. You are believing God for by mercy. Receive it. Let mercy deliver it to you now by the mercies of God. Receive it this morning by the mercies of God. Receive it this morning by the mercies of God. Receive it this morning by the mercies of God. Receive that job. 
Everyone who believe God for jobs, receive it by mercy. 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 Everyone who believe for marriage, receive it by mercy. Lugarabakasata, Eligrobo Kosiba. Everyone who believe God uh, for a business, you are pursuing something, it's not working. Receive it by mercy. 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 Malimonosa. Yalamalama. Rumalamanama. Alimanamana. Ozua Kataya. Rabakasha. Gaye Katabakodia. Lagada Kadakada. Marakalibodia. Receive your husband. Receive your wife by mercy, by mercy, by mercy, by mercy. Receive a new status by mercy. Let mercy do it for you. Let mercy bring it for you. Let mercy release it for you. Let mercy do it now. We cry out to God. Let it be done by mercy in the name of Jesus. Let it be done by mercy in the name of Jesus. You that is watching me, you felt by what you are going through. Is this how you are going to end? Is this how everything is going to end? Mercy will prevail. Mercy will prevail. Mercy will prevail. By mercy, a new door will open. What look like your dead hand? Before Robakadia will be the beginning of beginning for you. Will be the reason why you met your helper. Will be the reason why you entered your new level. Will be the reason why you entered your new season. Will be the reason why you see the miracle. I declare, let mercy prevail over every circumstances this morning. Over every challenge this morning, over every every delay this morning, let mercy prevail. Over every form of backwardness, let mercy prevail over that sickness. Let mercy prevail over that attack. Let mercy prevail over that conclusion. I don't know the wrong report. Mercy prevail over medical report. Mercy prevail over that institutional report. Whatever was said, reported, and it does not go well with you. Let mercy prevail over it this morning. Let mercy overturn it this morning. Let mercy reverse it this morning. Let mercy do it this morning. Let mercy release it this morning. By the mercies of the Lord, we decree this day here. Your name will carry mercy. Anywhere they mention your name, they will just look at it from mercy perspective. From mercy perspective. From mercy perspective, they cannot deny you. They cannot refuse you. They cannot resist you. They can look back at the Mercy speak for you. Mercy speak for you. Mercy speak for you. Mercy speak for you. Where you cannot reach, mercy speak for you. Where your voice is not, mercy speak for you. Where your name is, measure, mercy speak for you. Where your document is measured, mercy speak for you. We are admitted about to submit them. Mercy speak for you. Mercy prevail. Mercy prevail. Ah, in Jesus' name we pray. I want us to pray concerning our family. We want to pray over our family this morning. The Bible said, He said, I will, in Exodus, He said, I will come, I will visit the iniquities of the Father to the third and fourth generation. It means visiting iniquity upon a, a family to the third and fourth generation. That is when so many strange negativity begins upon in families. So many things begin to go wrong in family. But he now said, I will show mercy to the generation of them that love me. So mercy will always reverse, will always prevent a man from all manners of family assaults. I want us to pray. I want us to soak our family in the blood of Jesus. I want us to soak our family in the blood of Jesus. I want us to soak our families in the blood of Jesus. I want us to pray for we and our siblings. I want us to make that declaration this morning. Father, show me and my siblings. Show us mercy. Open your mouth and declare that. Show me and my family. Mention your names. Show us mercy. Mukali Munaya. Ali Susu. Daragadi Bokuziba. Show us mercy. Baragadi Bokadia. Rabakadi Bokadia. Mandikadi Bokadia. Say by your mercy, let us begin to escape every form of family curse. Say by your mercy, let us begin to escape every form of family delay. By your mercy, oh God, every negative is happening in our family. Let us not be a part of it. Let us escape it by your mercy. Evil pattern, we escape it by mercy. Every form of every form form of affliction in our family, every form of negative experiences in our family. Open your mouth and pray. Say, by your mercy, we escape it. 
we will not partake. We will not share that cost. We will not share that limitation. We will not share that battle. Open your mouth and begin to pray. We will not share that pattern. Let mercy begin to speak for me and my siblings. We escape family curse. We escape family pattern. We escape family bondage. We escape all by mercy. Languzuta. Halelemusha. Shanduru Katazia. Milele Kopokuya. Rapa Kuzia. Shatu Barabakadi. Lekurubakaza. Zurakata Bakuzia. Lekurubakazada. Yanga Rabakuzuda. Elikereva Kuzuba. Barabakada Bakuzua. Alik Rabakutubada. Bretu Barabatuba. Barabatuza da Rabatuza. Elikro Zuzuba. Elibra Huzibaya, Maraba Kutibaha, Eragadikizi, Praruba Sendirikia, Marabakadia. Mention the name of your brothers, your, your sisters, and begin to pray. The Yakadabakadia, whatever has been going on through generation, through third and fourth generation, whatever has been going wrong through third and fourth generation, whatever has been going as a pattern in my mother's family, my father's family, open your mouth and pray. Say, we receive mercy. We receive mercy. We receive mercy. We receive mercy. Not to be a part of him. By the mercy of God, we escape family pattern, negative family pattern. By the mercy of God, we escape that marital delay. By the mercy of God, we escape Open your mouth and pray. Let mercy begin to set me free. Let mercy begin to turn things around me. Let mercy begin to release me. Let mercy begin to speak for me. Open your mouth and pray. Lord, we give you prayer. Mercy. The Lord is showing mercy to somebody. I see mercy coming upon so many documents this morning. Documented write-ups. I don't know what about it is, but I see mercy coming upon them this morning. Ah, mercy is coming. Mercy is showing. Mercy is speaking. We are going to pray one more time. We're going to pray one more time. Thank you, Father. I don't know who you are. The problem you're having on your neck, that I've been moving sometimes to your head side. The Lord said to me, I have healed you this morning. Please, wherever that person is, I want you to indicate your hands up right now. I have healed you this morning. That is the voice of God. That is the voice of Elohim. That is the voice of Jehovah Rupeka. I have healed you this morning. I don't know who is here this morning. Somebody is around you very sick. I don't know who. I don't know who I'm talking to. If the person is on this altar or the person is connected to you. I see somebody went to visit somebody like an auntie that came to visit. And not long after the visit, the person has been falling sick. The person has been falling sick. The programming of the enemy is that that person will die in that house. The way the person is, the way is going. But this is what I would say. The mercy of God is going to speak that that person is going to be okay. But the moment you see the person, okay, let this person go back home. Go back to the village. Go back. Let the person leave the house because of mercy. God wants to remove a bad name that is about to be given to that person. That's what I'm saying. The person has stayed up for three weeks with the person. He came from home. has been sick. Mercy is going to make that person to get out of it. Let the person go back quickly. Can I can I hear from you, please? Good morning, Pastor. Good morning, everyone. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. It's about the word of knowledge. Mm. Someone I was having um, pain in the neck mm. and got the other person. Mm. So two weeks ago, I woke up and noticed that I could not turn my my neck to the left. Mm. So it was very severe. I didn't even go to work and I didn't go to work for like three days. So 
I went to the hospital. They were supposed to put, um, I can't remember what they call this, you know, my neck. So, but um, I told them, no, let me just be taking medication and watch it. So I can't remember how the pain vanished. Hmm. And you know, when, when, when the word was coming, but like, as if they, want, they wanted to put see all those white something just to help the neck, whatever. Or this. Yeah. Mm, 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 mm. But what did you feel? What did you feel this morning? Huh? What happened? What, what was your experience? I just realized that I woke up one day, it was two weeks that I had a severe pain, like for days. I just mm. woke up one morning. I can't remember the exact day, but I noticed that it just vanished. Mm, 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 just mm. vanished. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Now let me pray for you. Father, I thank you for your in the life of your daughter this morning. Amen. The Lord, I should decree upon you this morning Tattoos that he has won for you will mm. not raise their ugly head again. Amen. Do you have anointing oil there? I want to anoint you. I want you to put oil on your head and I speak that the content of that oil this morning. Marazuku Palis Kadiba. Yes, I have. All right, put it on your forehead now. The content of the oil in the name that is above every name puts an end to all forms of affliction on your body. It ends permanently, completely. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Raising of the anointing. Let Amen. No trouble you. Let no force, no devil trouble you. In Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank, Thank you, you, Jesus. And Lord, as you tell me, the kingdom of people where I see rage, that anytime they do something against you, something reverses it, and they rage that they are coming back. The Lord said, I will silence their rage permanently. Amen. Thank Amen. You, Amen. Thank you, Lord, Jesus. Jesus. And also, get ready to see God fight for you in your place of work. God is Amen. going to silence some people. And I saw something will be forcefully released for you. Get ready. Get ready for it. It's what Amen. I'm seeing the Lord doing for you. In Jesus' anointed name we pray. God bless you. Amen. Thank, Thank you. you. All right. God bless you. God bless you. Lord, I give you praise. We are going to pray. Now, if you've got any testimony encounter, apart from the one she shared this morning, you see, from, from, what, from what she said, it was not even today she was even healed. God, she just woke up and discovered it's gone. Lord, we give you praise. Thank you. But what God wanted to address that, like the enemy rage did not rise it again, was why God spoke that to her. Lord, I give you praise. I give you praise. We give you praise. Now, you have any testimony encounter you've not shared with us, I'd like you to indicate your hand by faith. Stand on your, raise your hand up, and share your testimony as we also pray and see your testimony with the blood of Jesus Christ. Now, we're going to pray. He said, though I walk through the valleys of the shadow of death, I shall fear no evil, for thou art with me the rod and the staff, they comfort me. And he said, Thou preparest a table before me, where? In the presence of my enemies. And he said, Thou anointed my head with oil, my cup runneth over. He said, Surely, goodness. I want you to understand something about the, if the place of surely, goodness and mercy falling in man. That's what we are praying. That is one more prayer we're going to pray to this morning. What are the effects of it? When you go through the valley of shadow of death, you won't hear anything. Mercy, when it follows a man, ah! it, the enemy can't write the last chapter of that man's life. He's even though you walk through the valley of the shadow of death, you will not fear evil. Evil will not overtake you. 
He said, even when the table is prepared and the table is surrounded by enemies, he said he will prepare a table in the midst of enemies. So when you have mercy, it doesn't matter. Just if you, you have the enemies, no matter the number of enemies, when mercy is there, he just can't finish you. They can, that is what you must understand. How can God be preparing table for a man in the presence of his enemy? We, we hide everything that we don't, the enemy should not know, the enemy should not know, the enemy should not know, the enemy should not know I bought a car, the enemy should not know I'm traveling, the enemy should not know I'm married, the enemy should not know. But why should God prepare a table in the presence of the enemy? Because goodness and mercy is following that man. The enemy know they can't conquer a man that can receive mercy. I want us to pray this day and say, God, from this morning, surely, sure mercy, let goodness and mercy follow me throughout this year. Follow me throughout every, through every second. Goodness and mercy. Goodness and mercy. Make that declaration. Goodness and mercy. Follow me. Follow my job. Follow me. Follow my business. Follow my children. Follow my husband. Follow my wife. Follow me. Every aspect. Bumper to bumper. Do Goodness and mercy, goodness and mercy, goodness and mercy. Ah, I love you, Jesus. That they, that they have just reversed a report. If you know what is already happening, that they have reversed a negative report. They will tell you the first one they brought was a mistake. Is mercy at work? A new report is coming. Glory be to God Almighty. I love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. Somebody is here, what have been profit for years to get? It's coming. They, you will just wonder what really happened. It's like him. Mercy has brought it out for you today. Thank you, Father. Let goodness and mercy begin to follow you, begin to follow you from this morning, from this morning, begin to follow your daughters, begin to follow your sons, begin to follow your siblings, begin to follow everyone connected to you, begin to follow everything you do, Right now in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Now, Rihanna, can we hear from you? If you've got any testimony encounter, let's hear from you. Can you share your experience with us right now? Yes, sir. Good morning, sir. How are you, Rihanna? Yes, I'm fine, sir. Um, I just want to testify, you know, um, I think Friday, the video was really powerful because I've, I'm really seeing positive impact in my business. Really positive impact. I may not really be able to share details because um, I don't know how to quantify it, but I will just say that God has really, really been faithful in a very, very miraculous way. You know, it's unexpected, it's sudden. And um, I would say that um, God has really blessed us on this platform. Like I've, I've, I've seen myself giving testimonies to the point that I would say, wow, I'm raising my hand again. Hope they will not say this one is always having testimony, testimony. But the truth is, from your teachings, I understand when you are blessed, you have to testify, you know, you have to thank God and you have to appreciate him and don't do it in silence, you know, so that to, um, to motivate other people and for them to believe because people's motivation has really moved me and I tap into when they give testimony. So I just thought about it. Why should I keep mine? I should come out and say, but I will tell you that I've had one of the best weeks so far. And I thank God. I'm hoping for more testimonies and I'm hoping I'm able to testify every week you know and thank god thank you so much sir god has really using you to get people like us who hardly believe these things you know what I say? It's, and that's what they will say you know but really i'm experiencing so many positive changes in different areas of my life and i'm hoping that um, i'm going to be touched in every other aspect of my life and thank you so much i thank you so much and god bless you sir thank you thank god thank god thank god thank god thank god thank you Bennett. God bless you. Do you have anointing oil with you there? Yes, I do. Take your oil in your hand. Let me pray for you. Father, I pray for Rihanna. We seal a testimony with the blood of Jesus. Amen. A testimony to pull out from the realm of the spirit more testimonies for her. Amen. To be released, we activate them in the spirit. As Amen. The anointing, I decree. Amen. Amen. Let your, let your miracles begin to break forth from the right to the left. Amen. Let the oil be a seal 
that greater things they release. Put it on your forehead. Amen. So shall it be. Amen. Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Amen. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. People of God, I want you to get, before we take communion, get this, get your anointing oil. Get anointing oil. Get your anointing oil. That's what I'm hearing now. That's what I'm hearing. Very quickly, get your anointing oil. The, there is, look, somebody, I mean today, I mean today, Monday, as you step out, you will be congratulated. The anointing to receive good news. The anointing to be congratulated. The anointing to be celebrated. Look at it being released. 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 Stretch your hands towards this prayer altar now. Lord, I convert the, both the oils in that hands to the anointing of celebration and good news. My Father, my God, that the Baru Gadayaba, that heavy good news, withdraw it by the by angelic assistance. We pull it down to the physical realm and I bring you to the space of those who own it. Whatever is yours in the spirit, I decree by this anointing, it shall be released in the spirit. There shall be an overturning, an overturning, an overturning, an overturning, an overturning, an overturning until it gets to you. Right now, we command massive, heavy testimonies. Down Paul, heavy rainfall of testimony. Heavy rainfall of testimony. Heavy rainfall. I decree, I declare. That good news you're waiting for for a long time. Let it come now. As the oil touches your head, Jehovah arise and let it bring good news. They will say congratulations. Somebody will open his or her mail. You will hear congratulations. You will hear congratulations. You will see congratulations. You will see congratulations. At the count of seven, you will put the oil on your head. There will be several encounters. There will be several encounters. There are some people, they will receive deliverance even as they are receiving their congratulation. There's forces and spirits that does not want good things to come to your life. They will scream out of your life and go. They will scream out. They will run. They will run out of you. They will run out of your feet. Some things will happen right now. It is deliverance versus celebration. Spirit will go out. Good things will come in. Evil spirit will go out. Good spirit will come in. Evil news will go out. Good news will come in. Evil powers will go out. Celebration will come in right now. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Are you ready? Thank you, Jesus. I want to plead the blood of Jesus seven times. One to go. Lord of Jesus. Two. Lord of Jesus. Three. Lord of Jesus. Four. Lord of Jesus. Five. Lord of Jesus. Six. Lord of Jesus. Seven. Are you ready right now? Thou power of God. Lord, give these words. If you are the one behind this altar, your fire is here. I want to see a proof. We want to see a proof right now. The proof of it is your manifestation of your power. And number two is the reality we begin to see after prayers. That today, 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 somebody will receive good news. Today, 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 Monday, it will be wrapped up and it's going to be delivered. Jehovah, at the count of seven, let the oil in the hands of everyone be converted to fire and be converted for celebration, congratulation, and good news. Lord, let it be so. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. <clears throat> Put it on your head. Now, receive. Receive. So, go, pa, 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 pa. Let things begin to happen. 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 Evil spirit, things that is blocking your celebration, that does not want you to marry, that does not want, oh yeah, come out. Vomit the things that even need to be vomit. Let them run out. Let them go. Receive your deliverance now. And let your good news come in. Let your good news come in. Let your good news come in. That money has finally dropped. That heavy breakthrough has, been, has dropped. I see things confirmed in the spirit. Oh. Jesus. Jesus. 
there is somebody, they will look for you by all means to give you your miracle. The anointing will not allow them rest until they find you. The oil that has landed on your head will take peace from certain system until they reach you. They felt they've reached you, but it has not reached you. They will continue to reach you. The Ruski Pali Limusata. People will travel miles just to come and give to you what is yours. I decree is done. This oil in your head, it shall be interpreted in good news. In celebrations. In the name of Jesus. Mercy. Adabha. Do you know the meaning of the oil on your head? Is mercies. That is it. That is what, that's what has come. Thank you, Jesus, for what you have done. Get your communion. In Kiru, I can see in Kiru's hands up. Let's get our communion right now. Father, bless this communion this morning. This is your blood and this is your flesh. As we drink it, let mercy speak for every one of us. Let mercy speak for all our families. Let mercy speak for us. That is what you ask us to demand for today. Everyone, oh God, hear us. Cry of mercy. Let mercy be our portion. As we keep the communion, we shall see mercy in the dimension of mercy in God. In Jesus' name. Please take your communion. Thank you. Good morning, sir. How are you doing, please? I'm fine. Mm. Good morning, everyone. I just want to testify to the glory of God. Okay. I don't know how to go about it, but God has really been faithful. When others were celebrating their Christmas and New Year, I was in tears. Thank you for your word of knowledge and your word of encouragement. I just want to testify to the glory of God that what the enemy meant for evil, all the things that the enemy meant for shame for me, God has really turned all of them around for my good. I just want to give God glory to God. I might not be able to go in details, but... I just want to bless the name of the Lord for giving me the peace that no man can give and the happiness that the world cannot give. May his name alone be praised. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you. Daughter, thank you for being with her through for her in all she went through and turning everything to testimony. We seal that testimony with the blood of God. And we declare God continue to do your work. Let your fire increase to do more. Do more and more when you hear for the glory of God. We ask that this testimony shall be a tool to draw more testimonies into our life. In Jesus, we silence all demonic forces. We command them to bow in shame. Amen. 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 Bless you. Every one of us will declare in the name that is above every name this morning. We decree that mercy will speak for you. Somebody will receive a 24 hour miracle. He's done in Jesus' name. Please have a wonderful and happy Monday. We we'll meet tomorrow again in the morning by 6 o'clock Nigerian time. God bless you. Bye bye.